Alrighty, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video on the channel. And today I'm going to be doing a tier list of every Skylanders variant. There are just way too many of these for me to actually make like a full ranking of them. And that would just say way too much time. So we're just going to do a tier list. So without further ado, let's jump right into this tier list. Alrighty, let's get right into this. I'm not going to take that much time for each one because there's way too many for me to do that. So I'm just going to go pretty fast through these. So Birthday Bash by Wolf Office, I don't like. I think the codes are really weird and they don't really fit him. A lot of these darks, which is pretty much a lot of what we got next. Blast Zone is awesome. He's an S tier for me. Food Fight isn't as good. He's still pretty good. Hammer Slam Bowser just looks kind of weird because his face doesn't have any different colors, but he's still really cool. Like, and I'm put him in A. Slobbertooth actually looks sick. He's like all black and silver. Snapshot looks really good too. Not quite as good as these, so I'm going to put him in B. Actually, I'm going to move Food Fight, Food Fight down to B too. Spitfire is a bit better though. He's A. Spyro is pretty cool too, but I think he's B, honestly. Stealth Elf is probably C for me. I, it just doesn't do it like it doesn't look that different from the original, in my opinion. I don't really like it. For this one, actually, it looks pretty good, though. I think this dark is actually really good. I think that's an A tier. Donkey Kong looks, he has the same issue as Bowser, but I think it's a little worse with him. I'm going to put him in B. Washbuckler is actually pretty cool looking. I'm going to put him in B, though. Like, it's it looks kind of weird because he's a squid, like having him like, all black and silver. Wildfire is one of the absolute coolest, so I'm putting him in S for sure. Excited Thrill P.I. I just don't like. Like, he's all white. It just, compared to the original, this one's not that good. This isn't going to be. It's not terrible. Like, it's not bad, but it's not that good. This one isn't that good. This one's bad. That one's a D tier for me. I don't like it. Enchanted Hulu's actually pretty good though. That's a B. Same with Enchanted Star Strike. Actually, this one's probably an A. It's a pretty good variant. Frightful Fiesta, I absolutely love. I don't know why. I just think this one looks so cool with like the all black outfit and then like the orange head. I actually really, really do uh, dig uh, Frightful Fiesta. Now we got Gnarly Barkley, which is for me probably uh, a tier, honestly. Like it's a, it's a, it's a mini, so it's already, it's kind of weird, but it, it's pretty decent. Gnarly Trurex though is an S tier. Like the blue and the slight hints of green, like it's beautiful. I love this variant. Same with Granite Crusher. Granite Crusher is absolutely awesome looking. I really like him. Now for Jade Firecracken, I think this is a B tier. Like it's nothing too special. It isn't bad though. I actually do like it. Jade Flashwing, however, is easy S. Jade Flashwing is a lot better than uh, Jade Firecracken in my opinion. Jolly Bumble Blast, I think, is another S. I actually love this variant. I'm not sure why, but he just looks super cool, in my opinion. I like the, the red and the white with the honey. It just works. Kickoff Countdown's a little bit weird. He's not bad, but I'm going to put him in C. Like, I, I don't prefer him over the original. I just think the design looks kind of wonky, like just making him a soccer ball. King Cobra Cadaver is an easy S for me. King Cobra Cadaver looks actually like amazing. It's one of the coolest, uh, coolest variants I've ever seen, for sure. Um... This, uh, what's his name? Legendary Astro Blast. He just looks weird. Like, the dark blue mixed with the gold does not fit him. I'm putting him in C. I think regular Astro Blast is better in every way, and this guy just doesn't look like the light element. Now, Legendary Bash? I think this guy is probably B. Like, he's not too bad. He's, uh, decent Legendary, nothing too special. Legendary Blade's a bit better. I think he's A. I just think it works better with his design. Like, I think the, uh, dark blue and gold scheme works pretty well. Boom Dash Roller Ball doesn't work as well. I think that's a B. Bouncer, I think is another B, doesn't work too well. Bushwhack, I the contrast is so bad between his massive translucent axe and just the gold and the blue. Like it does not look good. I think he's a C. Shop Shop isn't bad though, he's a B. Uh Deja Vu is probably a B for me too. Free Ranger is probably a B, honestly. Hurricane Jetvac is probably a B. Igniter looks so cool though. This is one of the absolute coolest without question. Like this looks awesome, bro. Igniter with the gold and the blue with the fire it looks amazing. Jawbreaker is uh oh oops not Jetvac. Jawbreaker is actually another pretty cool one. I'm gonna put him in A. I think the the fists look good with the color scheme, unlike Bushwhack over here. Jetvac is another B. It doesn't look too bad. A lot of these legendaries are just Bs in my opinion. Chill looks really weird. I think that's a C. That's not for me. Green Creeper looks pretty sick. I'm going to put him in A. Uh, Night Shift also looks pretty sick. I'm going to put him in A. Slam Bam, another one. He looks really cool. I'm going to put him in A. Legendary Spyro, I think it's B. Nothing too special. Stealth Elf, um, I mean, it's not bad, but it's probably a B like all these other ones. Trigger Happy looks really weird with this color scheme. I think it's the tongue that throws it off for me. That's going to be a C for me. Uh, Zulu. I do not think this color scheme works. Like his entire body is like this really dark blue. It just is not good. I'm gonna put that in C. 
Uh, this guy, Love Potion Pop, is actually pretty cool. I think that's an A. I think that's actually a pretty, pretty good variant. Mistletoe Dive Clops for me is another A. I really like this color scheme. The, between the green base and the green eyeball, it works really well with the red and white on the on most of the figure. Then we got uh, Molten Hot Dog, I believe. Yellow, it, for me, it's just not it. It's B. Like, it's not bad, but it could be better. Nitro Freeze Blades, an absolutely awesome awesome variant this color scheme looks so good with him just the the ice mixed with like the silver body and then there's just, like the golden nitro sort of design like, it looks awesome dude i love it nitro head rush i don't think the nitro complements head rush that well i'm gonna put it in b it's not bad though crypt king might be just a little bit worse but i think he's probably also b this guy nitro magnet charge looks really cool though i think that's another s right there like that is a really cool nitro um Polar Whirlwind is actually a sick variant. That's A for me. But like, I feel like it needs to have something a little bit cooler to bring it up higher, but it's really cool just having that like, metallic silver. Power Blue Splat, I don't think is that. Actually, I'll put it in A. I actually like Power Blue Splat. Power Blue Trigger Happy, not really, though. He's a B. He's not He's not bad, but he's not that good either. Power Punch Pet Vac is... I actually have this one. Uh, he's not bad. He's weird. He's different on the figure than in-game. In-game, he has like a dark blue, and on the figure, he has like a or uh, no in game he has like a dark red for most of his body on the figure he has just like black it's really weird but it's not bad it's b punch pop is this is for me probably an probably a tier i think it's about the same as love potion pop is for me quick draw rattle shake for me is another a like this looks like a pretty dang cool variant royal double trouble is probably an s not just because of how rare he is but he just looks super cool with the purple the orange staff and like the the hot purple pinkish gloves those look really cool scarlet and Ingenia for me is another s i don't know why but i just really like the red tail i think it looks super sick this one looks really weird i actually don't like it at all i think it looks horrible that I, I have it i think i actually own it does not look good same with this one it looks like throw up mixed with steel this one's pretty cool though this one's a solid a i think um i'm not actually sure what that's called it might be molten eruptor something like that i'm not totally sure Winterfest Lobstar is awesome, in my opinion. I think he's a solid A. This version of Chop Scops is actually really cool. It reminds me of Frightful Fiesta. It's got like the same sort of color scheme going on, and I really dig it. Dark Golden Queen is one of the coolest darks. I think that's an S right there. King Ben's not as cool, but he's not bad. He's uh, probably A tier for me. These two are horrible. I don't. The Easter designs, there's something just really bad about him. I just do not like him at all. Jingle Bell Chompy Mage, actual S tier, in my opinion. I think this guy looks beautiful and he i mean he looks like santa claus it's like legit I, I don't think that's why i like him but the staff the green mixed with the red and the white like this is just a beautiful variant legendary pit boss is probably an a for me i really like this guy and he's different in game than on his figure which is kind of weird but he's pretty cool legendary tried to not as good though i think he's a b tier. actually no he's a c tier it does not fit his design like he's a prehistoric dinosaur he doesn't look good with all these shiny colors mystical taekwon crow i think is a b tier i don't think it's as good as the original but it's not it's not that bad i think the silver kind of like grayish whitish beak just throws it off solar flare aurora for me it's definitely a i'm gonna put it in s i think between the black the gold and the orange it looks so nice i really like it steel plate hood sickle isn't as bad as smash it it's probably like a c tier it's still kind of got that throw up green to it which i don't really like but that's whatever dark wolfgang i think is one of the weakest darks in the entire series like i honestly think it's a c it does not look right on him like he just looks weird and mystical bad juju i think is an s tier variant this variant looks super sick between the red tail the red eyes the red swords it looks absolutely awesome that is gonna just about wrap it up for this video thank you guys very much for watching this is pretty fun to make if you guys want to see more tier lists please leave them down in the comments below i'm sure i'll look at all of them thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys next time bye guys